So the Galaxy S26 Ultra leaks just got a whole lot juicier. And this one might have spilled the beans on Samsung's screen plans for next year. Word on the street, straight from Ice Universe, is that the S26 Ultra is coming in hot with a 6.89-inch display, which, if we're being real, is basically the same as the 6.9 inches on the S25 Ultra. So yeah, no dramatic size change, but hold up because that doesn't mean Samsung is foaming it in. The real story here isn't the size, it's what Samsung is allegedly packing into that panel. Ice says Samsung's about to shake things up with new core display tech, and that's where things get interesting. And sure, I know what you're thinking. Didn't we just hear a rumor about slimmer bezels and maybe a bigger screen squeeze into the same body? Yeah, that's true. But here's the fun part. Both can actually be true. Smaller bezels, slightly tweaked dimensions, and maybe even some sneaky behind-the-scenes display magic Samsung hasn't shown us yet. But here's where things really get wild. Imagine you're on a crowded subway, you open your banking app, and instead of the person next to you trying to sneak a peek, you just see a boring blur. Meanwhile, you see your screen crystal clear. That's the kind of AI-powered privacy trick that's been rumored. And it's way smarter than those clunky privacy screen protectors that make your phone look like a flashlight died inside it. This all ties back to something big happening in Korea where Samsung Display is reportedly ramping up production on what they're calling Flex Magic Pixel technology. Sounds fancy, right? Basically, it's AI-driven OLED wizardry that lets the phone control each pixel individually and tweak viewing angles depending on what you're doing. So if this tech does land on the S26 Ultra, it could make privacy a whole lot more futuristic, without sacrificing that bright, sharp Samsung screen we all flex on our friends with. And that's not all. Apparently, Samsung's also cooking up a curvier design this time, which means we could finally see the Ultra ditch some of those sharp, boxy edges for a smoother, sleeker look. Honestly, I wouldn't hate it. So yeah, while the display size might not sound like a headline grabber, if Samsung pulls off this flex magic pixel trick, the S26 Ultra could be hiding one of the most game-changing features of 2026. The big question is, would you actually care about AI-powered privacy on your screen, or does that just sound like another gimmick Samsung's throwing at us? Drop your thoughts down below, I'm curious to see where you stand, I'll catch you in the next one.